Hello, crafty friends. I'm coming in with a haul and also some shares. So I was in a swap and also I got some happy mail from Tiffany McGill, Crafting Like a Boss. So let me share with you my um, Islet Outlet Design Team haul. They just sent me these new products today and I cannot wait to share these with you because they are so stinking cute. You're going to want to run in there and get some. Let me see if I can Zoom, there we go. Zoom in a little bit. Hopefully it doesn't affect the video. Okay. Guys, if you are a gnome lover, which I am, and I know Tiffany is, so if you're listening to this, look at what the Islet Outlet got in. They have a little gnome. Let's see, sorry. Little gnome brads. Oh my gosh, are these not stinking cute? Oh my gosh, look at that. Little striped green hat. And then we also have... A little red one with a polka dot hat and he has his little hands sticking out like he wants to give you a hug. That's so cute. Love it. Sorry, my hands are shaking a little. I've had a little too much coffee this morning. <laughs> and then we also have this super cute one. This kind of has like the fall colors in here. So he's wearing a little yellow outfit and then he has a polka dotted hat. Is that not adorable? Let me see if there's any others in there. I think they're all, yes. So the rest of them are the same. But guys, oh my gosh, they are stinking cute as all get out. Then, um, let me just let me just put these a little bit like that. Maybe, hopefully y'all can see those. Um, then we have these really fun Santa and Deer Brads. And again, I'm going to have all the links down below for you. But I wanted to show you these because I just love them. Look at those. So this reminds me of the Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, except that he doesn't have a little red nose, or if he does, it's so hard to tell. Maybe. I think maybe he does. Oh, my gosh. Is that not cute? He even has little antlers. I know it's hard to tell, guys, but stinking cute. And then we also have the Vintage Santa Claus, one of my favorites. So I absolutely love that. Let me see if there's any different ones in here. Nope. Just wanted to double check with that first. So I will put this like this and hopefully you will be able to see a little bit better without my hand shaking. I don't know. So cute. Then we have these really super cute um, Alpine Christmas trees or they just call them snow tree brads. Um, so I really love those. They have two different colors. You kind of have like a lighter green and then a darker green. So those are pretty neat. Uh, you know what? I should just take it out for you so you can at least see one of them. Okay. Let me see. Super cute. Okay. And then last but not least, we have Christmas Carolers. That is so cute. And they're called the Caroler Brads. And then we have a little girl right here. She's holding her little songbook. So cute. Then we have a little, a little boy here holding his book and he has little earmuffs on. So adorable. I know it's kind of hard to tell guys, but then we have another one. He's got little red earmuffs. So that's the green earmuff and red earmuffs. Let's see if there's a different girl in here. Yep. We do have another girl. No. Yes. She's wearing green. So, guys, adorable. You have to pick these up. They're so stinking cute. Sorry, I don't want to get these mixed up. I'm known to do that. But anyway, guys, let me share with you also my swap. This is from Julie Guile. So, I was in the um, Scrappy Boys first swap. And what we were supposed to do was create a Memdex card using their stamps. And so, Julie Guile's. It's either Giles or Giles. I don't want to get it wrong. But look at this. Isn't that cute? So she used the Jetsons. She did such an awesome job coloring. And I love the paper collection she used in the background. It's so retro. Like, And it says, out of this world. And then she also has, you're a blast. Isn't that cute? I just love it. Thank you so much, Julie, for swapping with me. Um, actually she was not my swap partner. Um, I had a different swap partner. So it was, I think it was kind of like random. We did it on Elfster. So I thought that was pretty cool. I can't wait for the next one. And then also Tiffany sent me some happy mail and look what she sent me. 
My first Jada Blossom die. Is this not cute? So both her and I are obsessed with gnomes and they're just so stinking cute. So she sent me the little girly gnome. I just love it. I cannot wait to use it. So let me see what size this little gnome is. Let's just double check. Does it say the size on here? No, I don't see that. But, and so you have plenty of layering pieces. So from the top of the hat down, it's about three and seven, five. So 3.75, three and three quarters. So cute. And the width, well, okay. So it would be about two and a half with her feet spread out. Is this not cute? I am so excited. I cannot wait to use this. So you guys are going to be some, seeing something like a super fast here because um, I love it. And uh, you'll probably be seeing a lot of gnome projects. Anyway, I love how they also give the um, ability to have two different hats. So you could do the polka dot hat or you don't have to. So that's really fun. Fabulous day. And I will be seeing you all again really soon with some projects. In fact, I have another one already on my desk, but you can't see it yet. <laughs> but anyway, it's going to be Halloween. So I will see you all soon. Bye.